Today at the Laurel Highlands High School, as officials in that community take stock of a threat made late last week, Megan Schiller is live with the details this morning. Megan. Good morning. State police will be beefing up security at Laurel Highlands High School. This was all done in response to a threat that was made against the school late last week. For that reason, kids do not have to report to class this morning. All classes will be canceled and they are set to resume class as normal on Tuesday morning. So again, state police is investigating this threat that first came in on Friday. Now state police say that they might have a person of interest in the case, but in they still want to give the kids the day off out of an abundance of caution. Also, they say what happened Friday at another area high school definitely impacted this situation. In that case, police arrested a 14 year old student accused of threatening to shoot classmates at his school. Police say that they found multiple weapons in the teen's bedroom and arrested the 14 year old. So in light of what happened also at that school in Uniontown, the superintendent at Laurel Highland says he wants to take every threat seriously. And the biggest deterrent that we have is that if you see something, say something to us. Um, the students are responsible for letting us know what's going on. Um, when you set silent, that's when bad things happen. So now today will be a teacher in service day and classes will resume on Tuesday. We are told that state police will be in and outside of the school building continuing to investigate for the remainder of the week until they learn more about the person who had that threat, made that threat against the school. Reporting live this morning, I'm Megan Schiller, KDKA TV Morning News.